Part 2, The Dark Secrets of Helga von Schaps. Welcome back to some more Wolfenstein the Old Blood, everybody. This is Part 2 of the last episode. 17th of March. It's a Sunday. The day of Purim. Yeah. I made this gift for my friend and father's workshop here in Wolfsburg. It's Jewish tradition to give food on this day. But I wanted her to have something special. What is it? A cat. Her favorite animal. I was going to give it to her, but then the Nazis came. You shouldn't so long here. Seems like a peaceful place. This is a city of secrets. Except through history by death and destruction. Now, Helga is poking a stick into its rotten guts. The morbid curiosity of a child. Was it in the Tasche? Blutblätter. My wife used to spread flyers like bees in Berlin. Nazi pigs put a rope around her neck for it. Keine Sorge, Annette. Herr Blaskowitsch kümmert sich um dich, wenn ich weg bin. Ich kann auf mich selbst aufpassen. Chapter 5 Wolfberg Agent Blaskovich, you're looking for OSA Agent 2. I called ahead to say that you were coming. Agent 2 knows where Helga is. Good. So much death for a silly folder. When we don't find it, there'll be a whole lot more. Me and Annette will hide in here. I stole some radio devices from the Nazi pigs. We can use them to communicate. Take this, and then get out of the boat and help me push it under the jetty. Leg dich hin, meine Liebe. Huh, just like that, he's gonna hide out underneath, huh? Anything else in here? Nope. That's all maxed out. That's all maxed out. Okay. Ooh. Signal detected. Time to poke my head up. Are you freaking serious right now? Well, at least one of the signals is down. Where's the other guy at? Give me all that ammo. Give me that. Okay, that guy's down. Where's the other guy broadcasting from? Whoa! I hear guys running everywhere. I think he's across the way, so I'm gonna... Big jump. Whoa. Here. Oh, I don't have any grenades. Oh, God. Okay, signal has been eliminated.
Okay, so where are we supposed... Oh, we gotta go... Looks like over there. Can I not get on this gun? Holy mother. Okay, so we're not able to get through there either. And it looks like we're wanting to go straight across again. Oh my god, reload. Come on. How did he survive that? Alright, so that guy's running back that way. So let's take this out. Oh, I still don't know how to get to my scope yet. You guys are probably telling me in the comments, but unfortunately, I usually record these in a ba in a big batch. So, all right, so we need to head over this way. So by the time you guys are commenting, I've already played past that part and never got a chance to, to see your guys' comments for that next video. I was hoping I can climb up the roof, maybe. Oh, God. Right, let's climb up the ladder here. It looks like it's wanting us to go like up and over this way. It's like off to the left, like over here somewhere. Probably shouldn't be using a sniper rifle at close range combat like this, but whatever. Oh god. I heard another shot somewhere. Oh, there he is. There we go. Where did that come from? <laughs> I swear some of these shots are just so random. Where the... I hear him. All sorts of goodies in here. We'll take that. This dude's like being super stealth mode. Ha <laughs> What's that? Kill as many Nazis as I can? <laughs> yep. No, I said... Can't hear you, Kessler. Lots of static. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of funny, actually. All right. That's a big boy down there. Hmm. How do we go about this one without making any noise? It's about to prove to be quite interesting. I'll take all this. Oh, we're maxed out on everything. Oh, God. Oh, God. He's, like, right there. Oh 
god. He's like right there. <laughs> oh, I cannot believe that guy really did see that. So we have a signal like 28 meters this way. I don't know of any other way to take down these big guys, though. Okay, well, there. Oh. There's one of our signals shot. Here's the other one. Oh god, please don't look up here. <gasps> yep, he looked up here. Oh crap, boys. We're in for it now. Here, choke on that. Choke on that, I said. My god, I was doing so well, too. Okay, that guy's down. There's freaking two of these guys, man. Where's the other guy at? There he is. <laughs> you can't shoot straight up, can you? Alright, let's... Oh, crap. Didn't mean to do that. Did not mean to fall. We'll just let him explode. Perfect. Okay, now we gotta come back this way. Alright, um... Can I get through this gate? Alright, so, how do I... Ooh, I definitely need that. Okay, so it looks like we're going to have to go maybe back through this way. Maybe up this truck. Come on, let me... Oh. There we go. I was just assuming, by the way, that we were supposed to go this way. It was a lucky guess. And yes, down here. Wolfburg Square. Ah, mein Freund! Mein großzügiger Nazi has in the heart knocked the ear. It's this guy again. <laughs> I'm glad I tipped you last time. Schmitz, the Baker shop. Kessler, I found Agent Two's house. Thank God. Dinner sits and singing in moonshine. Open the gate to the side of the building. There's a key underneath a large rock. Use the basement window. <laughs> Um. Ah. Found it. OK, 
Okay, we are in. Are we really gonna pry open their... Oh. Yes, we are. Bloody hell. Where's your shirt, you handsome sod? Pippa. Your agent, too. It's Nurse Inga now. Rest your feet for a moment. Have some tea and biscuits. So this is where they transferred you? Yeah. Six months now. Haven't seen you since the London HQ party. Oh, that was a riot. Wesley spilled beer all over my bristles. Clumsy twit. I tried to save him, Pippa. I know you did, love. I'm sorry. This is not the time for maudlin stories. Listen, I know what you're after, Blasco. The man in my bed over there is one of Helga's Nazi flunkies. Before he took a little nap, I loosened his tongue. The folder you're searching for is located in Helga's room at the Wolfberg Tavern. Now, apparently, she's quite the wine connoisseur. Pose as a waiter, and maybe you can get close to her. But for God's sake, put some bloody clothes on first. There's a shirt in the chest over there. There's a shirt in the chest. You need your guns. The tavern staff don't carry firearms. I'll keep them safe for you. Fucking Nazis. And people just follow these perks like brainless ghouls. Maybe they deserve nothing better. <laughs> Look at the arsenal. Where does he keep all these? Watch out, let me get that. They seem just arrested. Come help me with this, Blasco. The tunnel is a 9.4 meter swim to the well in the tavern's backyard. Return to me once you've obtained Helga's folder. And don't you fucking drown on me now, you adorable tosspot. Alright, let's go. Them hinges don't rust till I get back. Up we go, boys. Let's do it. Oh god. Okay, that's cool. It just died. That's cool. <laughs> Cousin Wilma owned the dive bar in Mesquite. Earned my first dollar there. Spent it all on rock candy. Sweet, sweet candy. I should put on an apron. Look the part. All right, let's get the apron on, boys. There we go. All right, we got our tray in our hand. Let's <laughs> let's do this. Oh my goodness. Supposed to be going this way. Excuse me. And we're supposed to be keep on going this way. Okay. Oh, hello. will Ergebnisse sehen. Und der goddamn folder. Ist er mit ihren Fortschritten nicht zufrieden? Ach, halten. 
Schicken Sie ihn weg, damit wir unser Gespräch fortsetzen können. Ach, Schreiner, verdammt nochmals. Lassen Sie mich doch erstmal meinen Wein genießen. Generalstraße wird Ergebnisse sehen. Ich bringe Sie zur Ausgrabung, dann werden Sie schon sehen. Warten Sie. Fuck. Ähm. Setzen Sie sich. Are you serious? Oh, no. Wie heißen Sie? Ähm, um, Franz. Franz? Mein Cousin ist auch so. Fasziniert Sie das, Franz? Als Kind habe ich meine eigenen Karten gezeichnet und im Wald bei uns zu Hause nach Schätzen gegraben. <lacht> to get the file and run. So konnte ich allein sein. Und dann? bekam ich auf einmal Polio. Ich war Monate ans Bett gefesselt, hatte schreckliche Träume. Und dann starb mein Bein ab. Habe ich deswegen geheult? Aber natürlich. Ist ja normal. Aber aufgeben ist was für Schwächlinge. Ich habe nie aufgegeben. Ich habe mein Schicksal in die Hand genommen. Haben Sie Ihr Schicksal in der Hand, Franz? Nur zu. Probieren Sie den Wein für mich. Und? Köstlich. Hm. Sie haben einen interessanten Akzent. Das ist der erbärmlichste Wein, den ich je getrunken habe. Der ist sauer, um Gottes Willen. Okay. Trinken Sie aus. Hm. Man riecht es sofort. Wie feuchter Keller. Muffig. Ein Hauch von Rosine. Und der Geschmack. Süß wie Portwein. Ein Rotwein sollte nicht nach Port schmecken. So was würde ich nicht mal meinem ärgsten Feind vorsetzen. Helga! Warum verschwenden Sie Ihre Zeit mit diesem Banausen? <lacht> Because, my dear, incompetent Schreiner. Uh oh. He's not a waiter. He's a spy! Did you really think I would be impressed by your atrocious German? Now give me the folder, Franz! Oh. Behalten Sie ihn im Auge. Was ist los, Eberhard? Eberhard, unternehmen Sie nichts, bis ich bei Ihnen bin. Verstanden? Okay, that stings a little bit. Oh! Oh my god. <gasps> that thing fell like right on my face. Chapter 6, Ruins. <laughs> and that's where we're going to wrap this one up, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed some more Wolfenstein. We'll see you for Chapter 6. Have a great day, everybody. Looks like a dusty old map.